Welcome back to the tea of the day. Today I have fresh apple mint. That's right, apple mint. Hmm, how that works, I don't know. I haven't seen any research to say why it's called apple mint yet. I'll have to look that up now, I guess. Um, let's give it a shot, why not? Hmm. Hmm. Now, um, I brewed this a decent length of time, but it almost feels like I could go longer because this is a very light mint. As far as mints go with the, um, the spearmint and the peppermint, uh, all the other types of mint I've had, gunpowder mint, are usually very much like, hello, I'm here, I am minty. And this one's like, am I mint? Yeah. I'm not going to really say it to you, but yeah. I meant, mm. and as far as the apple part, I'm not sure I'm saying uh, tasting an apple-y bit. Yeah, I really don't get much of an essence of apple, so it's not from the taste, I don't think. That's why this is called apple mint. Not as far as I'm concerned, maybe some people will notice some apple in this, but I'm not really getting that feeling. Hmm. Weird. So, I mean, it's good still, but it's really, as a standalone, it's not as ex exciting, not as ex ex exciting as regular mint. So, if you're having a peppermint or a spearmint, those can just stand on their own and be like, yeah, good tea. Whereas this one's like, I need some friends. I can't hang out by myself. I'm just too needy and dependent. Yeah, that's apple mint for you. So, um... I'd say try it with some other things or just some honey or something because by itself not as exciting um, but it has a few little interesting history bits because apparently the ancient Greeks used to use it to help clean their tables yeah <laughs> and they also would put it in their baths to help rejuvenate their bodies so uh, yeah apparently it goes back to the ancient Greeks and they uh, <laughs> liked it a lot but hey what do you know Oh yeah, it's also good for a variety of things like regular mint is. It's good for digestive problems. If you break it down to a powder and use it in toothpaste and things, it can be good for your teeth, of course. It's also supposed to be good for um, vaginal problems in, in an oil form, apparently. And uh, it's also good for, there was one other thing I'm forgetting. Um, there was something else. Oh, why am I forgetting it? Darn it. There are, um, maybe listed up here if not you'll well I'll, you'll have to ask me in the comments and i'll let you know then because i'll look it up right as soon as i'm done with this video and be like that's what it was Ooh, i knew there was something else that's all i got for apple mint today you all have a great tea day